guys, Billy here. Well, I just rescued this little bobtail, guys. Looks like it's been possibly um, attacked by a dog. It wasn't my dogs, but uh, or a cat. I doubt if it was a cat, or possibly it's been run over. You can just see the head has been injured, but it's in really good condition still, guys. And I'm feeding it some um, uh, some mulched up banana, passion fruit, and so forth. But Anyway, it's got a new home here at the moment, guys. It's in uh, my magpie's cage at the moment. It has been eating this stuff here. So, might be able to catch it eating some in a minute. Anyway, it's a bit stressed. It's all right. This is just its natural reaction, guys. They're harmless, but they're absolutely beautiful um, animals. These are extremely, extremely smuggled overseas. Worth around $3,000 plus on the black market. And uh, yeah, I've rescued heaps of these guys. I did a really amazing rescue video of a beautiful bobtail lizard or skink like this one. What was stuck in tar, it'd been in, in um, some melted road tar for probably well over a week. And I managed to save its life and remove all of the tar using olive oil to remove the tar. So the video link's below, guys, so check it out. So anyway, what I'm going to do is put some... Um, some betazine antiseptic ointment on that injury right there. It'll survive I reckon guys It's uh really active And it's like I say it's in the bird uh, scrapper's cage at the moment. There's some water there and also some of this so So anyway guys, I'll Keep him in here for a while and we'll patch him up and then we'll release him in my backyard and he'll eat all the bugs and insects and other stuff Alright guys, thanks for watching, see ya.